only to state that we are back to the original position that we took. And that original position is to say that the Minister of Finance will not be the one who must read the budget and must not be the one who do the appropriation. We are here this morning to say that this is going to be very soon for you to see the position of us. And we are going to be positively defiant on that posture until that action is taken. However, we are not going to support the cause of the NDC in the chamber this morning. The cause of the NDC is premised on falsehood, propaganda, and reasons that are not justifiable. Their position might look like ours, but it's not the same. You will not be able to come to the chamber to level 10 issues that brothers on criminality over a person who is not there to defend himself. And we have come to let you know, let you not confuse the public or yourselves about the cause of the majority and that of the minority. It is not the same. Ours remain as it is. After a meeting this afternoon, we will definitely come back to state our position, and it will be that, yes, our feeling is the confidence in the finance minister has gone down, but for COVID and for the Russian war, he was doing very well, the economy is doing very well, but when people are hard-pressed, they have no understanding to the logic of competence and hard work. And when they lose confidence, the only sector that when you lose confidence, it affects the market and affects the pocket of the people is the finance ministry. And therefore, for us, we have nothing personal against him. Our position is clearly that if confidence has gone down with him, he must go. And that is not the same as that of the NDC.